Hey Summit, this is Edward and this is your weekly update. If you'll notice, I am by myself today. Jake's not here, so I have two special guests that are going to help me today. And so I want to introduce them right now. This is uh, Olivia, my oldest daughter, and this is Lainey, my youngest daughter. And uh, I asked them to join me today for the weekly update, so make sure you share this on all your platforms. Uh, get the word out of what's going on as they gain composure. As you can tell, they uh, don't do this very often. Uh, so it is going to be the new year starting. When's the new year, guys? Is that Saturday, 2022? Is that right? 2022. So uh, excited. I hope you got big plans with your family this weekend. Uh, just a couple of things of coming up in the new year. Uh, we will be closed uh, Monday, January the 3rd. Uh, for our New Year holiday, and so we will be back in the office on a regular basis starting Tuesday morning. So just so you know, the office will be closed on Sunday, uh, on, Mo Sunday on Monday, January the 3rd. And then coming up next month is uh, one of our biggest weekends of the year. Guys, what's coming up on January 14th to the 16th? Be now. Be now. What is Disciple Now? Yeah, so you stay in homes and that kind of stuff. Uh, make sure you get your kids signed up. It's sixty dollars per person. That's for ages sixth grade through twelfth grade, right? And so they'll be staying in homes. Uh, uh, great weekend. Michael John Clement is coming. Uh, worship guy, y'all love him. His. Uh, uh, you want to say that a little bit louder uh, on that? So. Uh, Anyway, make sure you get your kids signed up for Disciple Now. <laughs> and, uh, that's going to be a great weekend. Hey, also on the second and third Sunday this month, on the second Sunday of every month in the new year, we will have grief support. Uh, if you're grieving or have lost someone and you want to go to that, that's right after the service uh, over at Generations Auditorium. They feed you. You don't have to say anything just to be a part of it. Oh, you do child care. Yeah, uh, they, they work for us at Summit as well in our child care area. So then on the third Sunday of the month, we have our women's cancer support group. Uh, if you're uh, a woman who has either had cancer or going through cancer, you want to be a part of that, make sure you get uh, uh, on, the, on your calendar of the third Sunday of the month. Guys, next Wednesday night, student ministry starts back. Y'all have a couple weeks off, and so... Uh, that'll be on Wednesday night. Libby is one of the worship leaders on that. We're trying to get Lanny up there to uh, lead worship, too, because she can sing, believe it or not. Uh, we're just trying to get her to do that. She makes a mean coffee as well. But uh, also, uh, Wednesday night, uh, student ministry, what time is that, well, Libby? 6 o'clock, 6.30, somewhere in there? 6.45. Okay, so make sure you get uh, get there on Wednesday night, say 6 o'clock, play basketball in the back. There's uh, food and music and games and all that good stuff, small groups. That starts back next Wednesday. Our children's ministry doesn't start back till January the 19th. So uh, be planning on that. Be looking for uh, Ashley's video. Uh, not video. Ashley has an email that she sends out as well, and uh, you can keep track with all of that. Hey, just real quick, I uh, just want to mention end-of-the-year giving. If you uh, are wanting to do an end-of-the-year gift, it needs to be post-dated by this Friday night, uh, the 31st, uh, by midnight. If you're going to do that, if you're giving online, make sure you do that before midnight on Friday night. So just a lot of things going on. New Year coming up. We're going to be cranking up on some things. So. Uh, we're excited to share this on your platform. Sunday morning, 10 a.m., I'm going to be asking a question, and how you answer that question can literally determine how you're going to respond to the next 12 months of this new year. So don't miss Sunday morning. Bring somebody with you. I know you'll be day after New Year. Uh, you'll be barbecuing and all that good stuff. But join us Sunday morning at 10 a.m., either in person or live. And so, girls... Thanks for joining me. Thanks for helping me. Jake couldn't be here because he's working. He's a loser. He's a loser. I like that. I, I may have y'all join me more often for sure. Uh, Summit, we love you. Have a great weekend, and I'll see you Sunday morning at 10 a.m. See ya.